Before we go over the equation of parabola, where the vertex is not at 0, 0, let's quickly review the equation when the vertex is at 0, 0. If it opens up or down, you start off of x squared. If it opens up, it's positive 4PY. If it's negative, I mean, if it's going down, it's negative 4 times P. Why? P is the distance from the foci to the vertex. If it opens right and left, you start off of y squared equals to 4p, the other variable which is x. Left, it is y squared equals to negative 4px. Now, what happens is, they're going to give you a different vertex. This won't be 0, 0. Yes. Yeah. So now they're going to give you the vertex, not at 0, 0, it could be somewhere here. If the vertex is, let's say, 3, 1, that is your h and k. And now what you're going to do is, to the x, you're going to subtract your h. The rest stays the same, 4p. And what happens to your y? You subtract the k. Okay. Here, same thing. If you have h and k for your vertex, oh, let's say it opens left. So your h and k, now what do you do? It is y minus what? k. The y coordinate of the vertex, you subtract from y squared equals to 4p, parenthesis x, minus h. You put x next to the x, y minus to the y. Okay? So this is the formula that they will give you. See? If it opens up or down, it's x minus h squared equals to 4p, y minus k. Here, if it opens right or left, it's y minus k, not h square equals to 4p, x minus h. So let's try it. They gave you the focus at 1, 4. And directrix is y equals to negative 2. So guys, when they say y equals to negative 2, it's locus, the set of points that has y equals to negative 2. So it forms a what? A line, horizontal line. So then, can you find the vertex? Where's the vertex? Right in the middle. So right in the middle, from the focus to the directrix, it will be right here, right? Or just count it. It's negative 2 to 4, so it's total of 6. Half of 6 is 3 and 3, right? That is your P3. Vertex is at 1,1. 1, 1. What is the line of symmetry? It will be perpendicular to the to the directrix and it goes through the foci and vertex. That's a line of symmetry where you can fold it and it will look exactly the same. So how would you write an equation of it? It's x equals to 1. So now, as you can see, it's like an alligator trying to go away from the directrix but trying to eat the focus so it will open up if it opens up then you should remember it is x squared equals to positive 4p y but remember when your vertex is not at zero zero you have to subtract your x from your x the y of the vertex from the y so now it becomes what? x minus 1, your h, this is your h and k, squared equals to, what is 4 times p? 4 times, what's p? 3, so it is 12, y, but now y is subtracted by k, which is 1. So that is the equation of the parabola when the vertex is at 1, 1. 
So it's x minus 1 squared equals to 12, y minus 1. So these are the vertex of the parabola. You don't FOIL them, just leave it as parentheses square and don't distribute 12. You just leave it as it is because this gives you the vertex. It's a vertex form. So now, let's go ahead and graph it. How do you graph it? You have to find the other two points from the foci. How much do you go left and right? 2p, which is 2 times 3, 6. So you go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The total length is this number, 4p. We call that lattice rectum. So then you just connect them and try to extend till the end of the grid and put the arrow. So here you have 4 comma negative 2 as a focus. And directrix is at x equals to 0. So you have to find all the point that has x equals to 0 so it becomes a vertical line. So what is P? The total distance from directrix to focus is 4, so vertex will be right in the middle. So the P is what? 2. And where would the line of symmetry be? It goes through the vertex and focus. So that is y equals 2, negative 2, and the vertex is at 2, negative 2. 2, negative 2, and remember that's your h and k. Don't forget to put that in your equation. So if you were to graph it first, now from the focus, you go 2p up and down, right? What's 2p? 2 times 2, which is 4. So you go up 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. You go down 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. So here is your parabola. Okay. You have to give me three points on the parabola so you can get the general shape of that graph. So now, how do you write an equation? It opens the right, so it is y squared equals to 4px. So it is y, but you have to subtract your vertex. So you start with y, so you have to subtract your k, not h. k is the y coordinate of the vertex. So it's y minus negative 2, which is plus 2 squared equals to 4 times, what's p? 2, which is 8. And now it's x, but x minus h, the coordinate of the vertex. It is minus 2.